So far, we've looked at sketching vertical translations of exponential curves. We're now going to have vertical translations, but also horizontal ones as well. So in this example, we're going to have y equals 2 to the x minus 1 plus 3. So the first thing you want to do is identify where the horizontal asymptote will be, which is when y is equal to 3. So that is the first thing I want to draw on. Now, the fact that we've got x minus 1, all that means is that it's been translated one unit to the right. So we still have an exponential curve. It'll still look very much like we used to. We just need to work out where it crosses the y-axis, which is when x is 0. Now, when x is 0, we're going to have 2 to the minus 1 plus 3. So 2 to the minus 1 plus 3. Now, that's the same as 1 half plus 3, so 3.5, or 7 halves. Okay, so that is where it must cross the y-axis.